We've talked about spacesuits from the Apollo program, but Kathy, what are the spacesuits that go to Mars going to be like? Well, that's a really good question, and that's a question that's, that people are working on today. There are a lot of people who are looking at different aspects of spacesuits, from gloves, from joints, and one of, one of the many things that they're looking at, they want spacesuits that are reusable, much like the current EVA suit that the astronauts use today, but they're also looking for spacesuits that don't have time limits on them. Now astronauts are limited to the ability for them to flush out carbon dioxide when they're breathing, so they're limited to about eight hours in the current technology. They're looking for suits that even though they're going to get dirty, and they are going to get dirty, you're going to have people rolling in the dirt, they don't want to bring that, that lunar or Martian dirt back into their living habitat. So they're looking at ways to design suits that attach to a mobile environment. So the astronauts can exit the suits through the rear, but the dirt of the suit is still on the outside. So it's sort of like having a mudroom built into your habitat on another planet. So, and there are many more things that people are working on in order to prevent injuries. One of the major cause of injuries to astronauts today are use injuries. They suffer from shoulder injuries and elbow injuries from wearing spacesuits and practicing in neutral buoyancy tanks. And it's, it's very exhausting and they're getting prone to injuries. So they're looking for new materials in the restraint system so it's not so hard on the joints. And that's especially a concern when you have astronauts walking around on the surface. If your elbow hurts, you can use it a little less. If your knee hurts, that inhibits your ability to explore. Kathy, when one of our friends takes their first step on Mars, would you like that suit in, in the collection? I have dibs in for that first suit <laughs> everywhere and everyone who's working on it, all of the contract and prototype suits, and I think my photo has been posted at Johnson Space Center. <laughs> I'm not allowed to enter with a large suitcase. <laughs>